Hello everyone, welcome back to the Journey to 2000. We are currently at 1883 um, because I lost a bunch of games yesterday. It happens and we move on. So now we're going to get into another 10 minute game. We play white against Fly T Fly. Fly, thank you, Fly, something like that. Gonna look at his stats. Yeah, he looks legit enough. Got a doggo on his profile. Why not? French defense. We play the Papaticulate Gambit. This is a move, that's also a move. <laughs> and this is what we do, baby. I'm gonna start playing a different system, I think, where instead of, instead of queen here, which I think is the correct move, I might start playing this. To really get my bishop active. Yeah, I'm gonna look at that after the game, because I know that's a move. Um, I don't need to take that pawn back immediately, so. We might start seeing some pawns fling down the board. This is usually an opposite side castle and kind of position. I find French positions sometimes to be kind of boring, especially since I end up exchanging usually because I don't want to deal with a lot of the ideas of the French. So, yeesh. Let's do this. This, 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 here. Usually you sometimes see knight here. Okay, okay. They take back. Maybe they do this. Get their bishop to the long diagonal. Yeah, 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 you're not creative, you're not creative. We'll do this. Maybe it was better to do this, to then come here and then get my bishop here. I don't know, it's fine. Then if I came here, you maybe would have taken, taken. Well, actually I could have taken with my bishop. We shall see what happens. King b1 cannot be a bad move. Now, one of these moves might be my follow-up. And we get a very nice position. Very nice position. So, okay, maybe they're indicating they want to castle long. You want to castle long, eh? Mm -hmm. I see no reason to not just start doing this sort of deal. That looks a lot of fun. Obviously, I wouldn't be able to... Here, here, I'd, I'd probably lose a pawn, but... Just felt like something stuck to me for a second. I'm gonna do this. I have ideas to potentially plant my knight in there, especially if they castle long. I have ideas to do this with a forkety fork. Could also achieve that via this method, but just kidding, the queen defends that square. I can't draw arrows, you guys know what I'm trying to say. Oh. Not sure what my opponent, yeah, that's. So this immediately threatens this bishop, which would, I would love to take. Ooh, here, 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 I'm good. I'm gonna do this to hit the bishop, threaten this fork. Maybe he has to go back, bishop e8. I don't know, kind of depressing for him, to be honest. If that's what he has to do, but I don't see another way to stop this fork. I guess he could just do this. Then I'll happily take your bishop. I will happily take that bishop. Webcam for a quick second. Hope you guys are having a great day. Just a wonderful day. My opponent clearly did not want an opposite side castle in kind of position. I feel like one of these moves has to be your move. I don't know how else you... Yeah, that's what I figured. Now I really just want to start sending pawns down the board. Now I can't do this because that blunders a rook. That blunders a rook. Is this just too weakening? I don't know. Here. Here to come here, I guess. I don't know. He still does not have this kind of trick. I'm trying to go for back rank stuff because I have this. I also just have queen takes. So maybe he does this. Then I might just really solidify that knight in there. 
really just solidify it. If he comes here, maybe I still just go forward with this plan. Start expanding. Get my pieces out. I would like to my I would like for my rooks to be connected if possible. I like my position. I like my position. Sorry for not getting a video out to you guys yesterday. I realized. So he wants to exchange bishops, probably. Because this is a pretty good bishop. I mean, not a great bishop, but it's pretty good. <laughs> here, he threatens, comes here. Can't come here. It's not threatening any kind of takes. I feel like my pieces are pretty well mobilized. So I have ideas to just come here and here and just start really harassing the king. Is this too passive? I don't really see any other moves. Here I just drop back, I feel like. So I'm going to move forward with my plan of just doing this and this. I feel like my opponent spent more time than me, but why the heck? That's not very nice. Why you hop in your knight in there? Why you hip hop in your knight in there? So maybe here, here comes back. Could maybe do this now. He takes, I take, he takes. My pieces are really getting, if he does this, or even this, and I come here, my pieces are just kind of getting in each other's way. Oh, it's not fun, things getting in each other's way. So it's maybe better if I do this, hit this pawn. I always have the option to come back here. So not the worst thing. Yeah, this is the move I'm going to choose, but then that kind of just willingly pins me. But I, I, this, pawn, uh, this knight is well defended. I even have ideas to do this. He comes here, I come here, takes, takes, bishop is hanging, I guess he could take this. Not sure, not sure, but maybe he comes here. At which point I definitely will do this. Yeah, if he comes here, I think that might be a blunder. Hmm. Yeah, he was worried about that pawn. That's fair. Any tactics here? I kind of don't want to do this to block my queen's access to that square, so I'm going to do this. I think... Kind of just a basic threat, but you're getting... His king, his queen is not really in any good position right now. It doesn't really have very many squares. You can rule out these. Guess you can't rule out this one, so he can't, he doesn't have this one, he doesn't have this one. He has, he does not have this one, he doesn't have this one. He has these two, but that's just getting in the line of my bishop, so I might have like, I don't really have any meaningful discoveries. Unfortunately. And the thing is, is even if I move my knight, my bishop's just hanging. So it's not like I could, you know. I'm confuzzled. Isn't that a free piece? Here, here, and just here, and I've won a piece. Right. 
here, here. And I've won more than one piece, in fact. That was cool, I guess. I don't know why they did that knight move. Um, yeah, weird. I, I played with 87%. They played with 73 So not a great game by my opponent. Okay, so I know this is a book move, but where does it rank this? Wow, it gives black a pretty good advantage. Yeah. I don't know. I've had positions where they take and they take, and I just, I really like this bishop on this diagonal. Nine times out of ten people castle this way. So I know it gives black the advantage, but I don't know. I don't know. Practical reasons. I could still castle short if I really wanted to. This is not bad for me. I Look at these bishops. Like once they start opening up, it's just an avalanche on the king. Yeah, it's it's better to do this and allow your bishop to get out. Yeah, I should have saw that. Whoops, it easy. This is a mistake for why. I guess I guess yeah, that's fair. Um, you immediately win a bishop. That's fair. That's actually very smart because this bishop's doing pretty well on this diagonal. I do have ideas to maybe fianchetto. Okay, that's a. I, I'll I'll keep that in mind. <laughs> yeah. Best. Yeah, they had to do that. But what about what about mayhaps this? I know it's depressing just to leave your I guess there's this, but where does that rank in the top engine lines? So it says F3 is a move. F3 was a move I was considering in order to potentially uh do what exactly? I'm not sure. <laughs> I was gonna F3 came to my mind, but Queen down is a move. Queen E3 uh, yeah, it's just like get this bishop out, man. Uh, okay, cool. <laughs> and now it doesn't like this move. I literally did it one move later and it immediately doesn't like it. So mistake. Okay, good. I was thinking of this, but I, I, I really like the bishop on this diagonal. The queen, the queen should be uh, the supporting actress, as uh, um, Yasser says. It should not be the main uh, thing orchestrating everything. It should be there supporting uh, the whole... Uh, the whole play, so to speak. Yeah, that's just a blunder. And then that's just another, yeah. I'll be up six points of material here and this is obviously easy. Cool, well, uh, we're back to 1890. I'm gonna keep it to one game. I know that's probably not gonna be something you guys wanna hear, but I'm gonna keep it to one game. I, I just know myself well enough to know if I play another, I'm gonna lose. So I don't wanna do that to y'all. Thank you so much for watching. Kind of a, actually, that was a short game. That was a super short, basic kind of game. So I'm going to play another against an 1816. Pat Fuse 77. E4, E5. <sighs> Let's see what they do. Okay, good. I was really hoping they wouldn't do something like this. Interesting, interesting. I think I still go here, yeah. Yep, so that's main line. Then I hop in here. I think that's what I do, right? Probably takes here, I come here. Interesting, interesting. When I do this move, is that a move that does absolutely anything? Could also castle here, here, here. Castles is interesting. Castles, he takes here. I low-key kind of want to take here first. Here, he's just going to solidify his pawn structure. I don't want to do that. This is the obvious move. But we don't believe in making obvious moves in this, uh... Castles. Right. Okay. Cool. It would have been nice if they delayed castling by one move, because I would have been able to do this. But then they could have just done what? Maybe this? It would, they would have been able to... 
they wouldn't have been able to solidify their position their position so i have this idea just kidding no i don't that'd be dumb don't do that don't do that you nimrod I do have this idea though, just to hit this pawn, just tickle the pawn. I don't think you can push. I feel like that's not advised. That'd be a crazy move if he pushed. Maybe he just does. That seems crazy. That seems crazy to move to to push there. There's a reason that they say don't put don't don't. Don't push F3 because it's it's crazy. They are from Botswana. I should have checked their account. They seem legit. I mean, they, they're not making moves at weird intervals. Wow, their peak is 2076 or 2067, I should say. Here, they're definitely going to take. Here. So here just they, they just solidify and I don't even have this square anymore because this pawn is defending that. So I shall do this. I shall do this, still hitting this pawn. I don't know why I immediately started speaking with a French kind of accent. But you know, sometimes it just happens. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But I see I, I you just you, you push this thing so now here you come back I guess I don't have a way to win a pawn it do I here comes back I come here threatening to win a pawn here here nothing Let's do this. We'll come back. You can't do this or anything because obviously I just take a free bishop. Yep. Here. Here, maybe he pushes again. He does the crazy thing. He does the crazy thing. Ooh, I think this is a good move because I do have ideas to do this, but then he can just push. Defended by the bishop and the rook. So maybe I do this first to get the rook off this diagonal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here. Here seems logical. Or I should say here seems logical, but not really. Not really. Here and just here. And I'm kind of just got nothing. Just got nothing. Got none. Absolutely none. I don't even know what the best move is. Maybe this. This to pressure the pawn. Yeah, they are playing, oh, I should say, not well, I would argue. You might do this to threaten this pawn, at which point I think I'll have to take. Like he's also given me just a great like this 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 bishop is gonna be great here. He's just pushing pawns, man. He's just pushing them. I wish this came with some venom. I'm gonna do it. 
because it looks like it comes with some venom. Maybe he just does this. Just kidding. Just kidding. Just kidding. Just kidding. Just kidding. Just kidding. I'm going to immediately bring this bishop here. I guess he probably just does this, though, annoyingly. If he does this, though, then I can just take this. Go here, I suppose. Here. Here. Your bishop sucks too. Like, I know mine sucks, but yours sucks even more. I sound like a fifth grader trying to argue with somebody. Here, say he does nothing. Takes, takes. Seems logical, logical, logical. Best thing for me, though, is this would just be such a pawn that would be so hard for him to defend. Very hard for him to defend. Oh. Wow, I have four minutes and he has seven and a half. I need to speed up. I need to speed up. Mayhaps this. Here, here. Uh huh. Here. Yeah, my bishop's undefended. Of course, I see that. Very nice. Okay. Could have done this maybe to try and win this pawn, but he could have just done this or just taken. Maybe this reroute as well to continue to defend these pawns. Here, here. Yes, Queen has to continue defending the back rank because he does have back rank weaknesses. And now that I mention it, so do I. <laughs> Unfortunately, every one of his important pieces is on a dark square, which is not fun for me, but I'm trying to put things on light squares. Or my best to at least, you know. I got to speed up a bit. Sucks that I lose 10 points if I lose this game and I only get 6 if I win. Okay, yeah, he solved the back rank weaknesses, but I feel as though he's only made more weaknesses for himself with that kind of a move. Ooh, can't do that move. I'm gonna do this. <laughs> So I don't hang back rank. Good 
feels like a useless reroute, honestly. This is the sort of situation where I'd rather have a knight. Like, imagine a knight just right here on f4. Oh, 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 oh. Here, here. That does nothing. Yeah, good defensive move by him, as it turns out. Maybe he can just do this, though. Yeah, 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 yeah. I see you and your trickery. Getting this now. He does this. I have ideas to come here and here and just really start harassing him. I only have a minute and a half though, so I'm gonna to have to start playing some bullet. Unfortunately. Unfortunately. I dare you, I double dog dare you, mate. I dare you to do that move. I dare you. I come here, maybe he just does this. Come here, takes takes. And he's just like, ha, 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 you have no time. Probably this, if I had to guess. I think this would have been better in order to usher this in as well. Probably just this, but he can't do that because of this. Or maybe, yeah, he can't do that either. He can't, he can't do, I don't know what he does. That was the wrong move. That was the wrong move, I personally believe. So he's pinned, so the bishop can't move. His king also has no squares. Crucially, I also have this idea, maybe to do some, you know, if this queen moves, I'll have some back rank. Probably not that square because of the rook. I mean, the queen and the rook are not leaving this post. Yeah, I think this is probably just forced checkmate in a couple moves. If I had to guess. He has nothing here. I just come up and he doesn't have a, he's not on any light squares. He's got, oh. Here, come up, here here just there so i mean uh what's it called you know knock on wood and all that stuff but i think this will be a win i think this will be a win yes 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 oh you know it'd be a baller move so here This is forced. This is forced. And then I come here and here. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, look at that. I do not know how you stop this move because obviously you can't push this. Yeah, bishop d3 is a really nice move. 
Bishop d3. Oh, maybe maybe this was more accurate, actually, to threaten this. Ooh, 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 ooh. I'll have to check with the eval later. Bishop d3, uh, Bishop d3 or Bishop e2. One of these two moves was easily the best move, without a shadow of a doubt. I don't know which one, though. Bye. Got nothing there. This is forced. This is a, that's just checkmate, also, by the way. Just checkmate. Just checkmating him. Just force checkmate. I can pre-move this. Wow, nice game. Nice game. That was a, that was a cool game. Um, it said I blundered once, um, which I believe. But I played with 85% accuracy. Not bad. Respectable. They played with 74. They did not play a bad game. So this is all mainline stuff. This is all mainline stuff. They come here. You push. This looks really scary. This looks really, really scary. Um, takes is not an idea. Okay. Yeah, I figured not. You have to counterattack. That's, I think, the only move is d5. If you do anything else, you're surrendering an advantage. If you try and do this, it's already plus one for them. I don't know what move they do to... Oh, yeah, just that. Just that. Ooh. Oh, that's really cool. That's a really cool line, actually. But anyway, this is the only move. They come here. You jump your knight in. So that's not the best move. Castles is the best move. I had a feeling castles was the best move. I felt like it. Get out of the pin. I was to just not even take the piece back. Uh, sir, what do you, uh, sir, sir. Oh, if here, here to hit this and this. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh, okay. Just kidding. That, that, wait, hold on. So that is not even the best move. F6 is the best move in this position. Taking the free pawn is not the best move. What if they just come back? Oh, I guess you're hitting this, which is hitting this, which is the only... <laughs> and if you try and come here, you're just getting throttled. Oh, yeah, look at that. It's <laughs> mate in 18. If anybody finds a mate in 18, oh my god, putting yourself in the direct line of the pin. But what about this? What about just this? There's no forking ideas. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, there's, there's that idea. Whoops, I missed that just fully. Anyway, okay, we didn't go into all that. So next time I'm in this position, I will make sure to push F6. But I'm just curious though, like their best move is push, which is, or not that, I guess, I guess it's bishop, I guess it's bishop here, which makes sense. Block this whole thing, continue to defend this, which is fair. And then my best move is to do that. Okay, no, it's, it's to take this. Finally, get the the piece back. Get the piece back. And if they still try and take this, oh, queen takes an oh, just an avalanche, just just an avalanche. But what about this? Or just what even just castles? Oh, look at that. Okay, you remove a defender. Well, I guess you can't move that actually. It's saying knight there. I said, yep, just just get the piece. Oh, you don't even take the rook. You don't even take the rook. What if here? Now you take the rook. Okay, cool. And you're up two points of material. After all of that, what seemed like I was giving away pieces. That's so cool. Okay, well, I don't go into this sort of line often, but. You guys seeing what I'm seeing here? Y'all seeing what I'm seeing? Whoops, why am I in this weird view? Okay, um, just don't uh, do anything about the piece, just here and here, and you're chilling, I guess. Oh, well, you're gonna win the piece back. You're gonna win the piece back, but what if here? And then just here, and you still have that pin going. That is very, very cool. And if a6, a5, and what if here? Yeah, just bam. And you're just enjoying all sorts of free stuff. Oh, I was gonna, huh? Huh? I was gonna say either take this or take this, but Stockfish is like, no, 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 no. Give away a free bishop for why? Bishop takes, bam, okay, I see that. 
Oh, and you get the rook back. Okay. And you get a rook at the end of it all. Because the queen is the only thing. Oh, look at that tactic. The queen is the only thing defending this pawn. I love, I love deflection tactics like that. I love them. They're fun. Cool. Okay, cool. Well, none of that happened. Obviously, I'm not that ambitious. I moved the knight. They did that. I come here. Stockfish is not liking anything I'm doing. It says that's the best move. Because I had the right idea. Like, I just want this. I want this. This is the file where a lot of stuff's going to happen because you, you opened up your king. I'm, I've got this bishop on this nice diagonal. Your king's going to have to move over, but I'm going to be able to get some nice counterplay. I shouldn't say counterplay, but... And this just traps the... No, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. Shut up. Don't do that. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, that's that's a tactic that, uh, you know, that's a tactic a 1900 should be able to see. That's a... Uh, ooh. So here, what's their best move? Is here. Fair. Just be like, oh, sorry. <laughs> Have a nice day. You don't even move the rookie rook because you got the same tactic i'm assuming or hold on i guess you take this oh but then maybe you're pinning the knight to the queen no but it still wants bishop takes but what if here oh it's it's a it's a it's a check okay wow this opening is a lot more cool for black than i thought it was awesome why would I ever go into this? this? These lines look awesome. I guess because of idiots like me who don't know how to capitalize on them. Okay. So get out of the pin. I think, I'm surprised. I figured you had to take, okay, you take with the bishop. You take with the bishop. Okay, fine. I was going to say because they're threatening this and I don't want to lose another pawn. Or I guess I should say a pawn. Yeah, bad moves. Just super weakening for the king. Super weakening just to move your... Yeah, I had to take that. It was, it was not good. So black is winning here. Even though, even though it kind of feels like... It, White is the one with, they've got two pawns in my area, defended by two other pawns. I can't take either of them because they're defended by a bishop. Bad bishops, uh, they defend good pawns is like kind of a phrase that I feel like I hear a lot. Um, bishops that are kind of biting on granite, as a certain GM likes to say. It's fine sometimes because they're defending what look to be good pawns. And even if not, you could always like do some reroutes if you really want to like, I don't know. I don't know. So anyway, that didn't happen. Bam, bam. Wham, bam. I have to do that because I do want to get my rook into the fold. That was not the best move. It was this. Okay. And then I bet if they just did, I don't know, something random. Okay, it's this. I was always thinking of doing bishop d3 at some point, but okay, whatever. I went rook b3. Rook b3. Best. I, I feel like this is a very good prophylaxis kind of move by white because they it wasn't even my threat to come here, move, and then take this or something. It was not even my threat. Oh, I did have stuff like this. Nope, don't do that. Oh my gosh. If he had stayed in the, okay, I see. Okay, I would have probably saw that. I probably would have seen that. I probably would have seen that. But obviously that didn't happen. So moves here. H6? He wants H6 in this position? Crazy. And then I capitalize with this and it's, yeah, it's it's plus 39. There's nothing for black to do. Let's go rook A8, which is nothing. I move the king and it's forced mate in seven. Forced mate. You have to give up the rook. Yeah, you, you literally just have to start sacking pieces. My opponent did not do that. So that's not even the best move. I can find the best move, Yonatan. Huh? That? The forest mate. Bishop d3 is the best. Oh, no, it's not. Okay. He keeps telling me different things. He keeps telling me different things. He keeps saying that, but okay. Obviously... It keeps telling me different stuff. I don't know. But anyway, so that, it, you have to give up the queen. But even there, it's still forced mate. Probably just this, I'm assuming. What if here, just checkmate on your head. Um, anyway, cool. Best move. I like that best move. What, 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 what would it what, what would have thought of uh, this? What would it have thought of this? It's still forced mate. Just a little bit longer, I guess. Oh, okay, yeah, I, I get that. I, okay, that's fair, I guess. And then here, here, and then it's just uh, 
it would have been forced to mate in one. I'm so bad at finding quick mates. I'm really bad at it. You guys were probably laughing at me, but this is just still forced, so. Cool. Well, we got two nice wins. We're back up to 1896. That will definitely, definitely be the only game I play right now. Um, two nice wins. Just two, two nice. The first one wasn't so nice because my opponent just kind of hung a piece. But this one was nice. I had low time. I had to kind of, you know, find some good moves. And uh, we got the dub. So can I get some W's in the chat, baby? Can I get some W's in the shot? W's in the shot. Anyway, I'm going to stop sounding like a uh, 10th grader and uh, bid you guys adieu. Which, by the way, funny story, I was at work today, and one of my coworkers, I said, I bid you adieu. And he was like, that's not how you say that word. And I was like, what are you talking about? In my head, the word adieu, like, you know, without further ado, that is spelled A-D-O. I've known that. But I always thought I bid you adieu was the same word, but it's not. Adieu is like a French word. It's like A-D-I-E. There's like a bunch of vowels in there. It's weird. The French language is insane. But you learn something new every day. If you thought adieu... And adieu, I don't know how to say it, are the same word. You were, like me, incorrect. But you learn something new every day. That's the great thing about life. And I learned some new stuff about the Guccio Piano center attack. And also that those two words were completely different. So anyway, thank you very much. Without further ado, I will uh, bid you guys adieu. Take care. <laughs> that was so cheesy. <laughs>